Hey guys, what's up? Today's video we'll be talking about the information about the new Fall Guys Fall Forever update launching tomorrow. Today's. So the new Fall Forever update invites beans on an endless exploration of the Blunder Dome with a brand new mode in Explore mode and infinite expansive levels of space for you to enjoy. Play as long as you want to and then collect to and then collect rewards. Fall Forever update will launch on May 7th. With explore mode, there's less waiting and your endless levels have a chill time with friends. Explore keeps the party going with a non-stop flow of your made levels to be used and your party to dive into. Not feeling a level? Skip to the next one. Explore be built with the feedback we've seen from tools like Outdoor Adventures. See below for the features that make up this new mode. We've heard! You don't like playing, so this mode allows you to queue up the next level of the moment you talk to you. Not being a level, you added a skip function that will help you hop onto the next level wherever you like. Explore is a 10 player mode to match between 2 players that make new friends. For courses formerly called races, we have set timers to fit in that allow you to Had a long play session and need a break? Feel free. Rewards will be waiting for you based on how many levels you've completed. You will also have to get more challenges and more challenges. Explore the most popular ways for the never evolving outcome that looks like a music game of rounds. It's open to the most memorable rounds to be an explorer so that it is fast, endless, and so we can find the execute level. If you enjoy a level, let it be known with a like. To level you don't care for, just hold the skip button and continue to explore. Levels will also automatically update if you're detected. This means curious can have the levels data, so if you have a chance to see their changes in your life. Fall Guys is better together, so we have added ways for you to help us communicate with others. Use these new social features to better play as a team or others to offer help to other players. You can now request help from your fellow being by pressing the piggyback button. Once pressed, you'll see a big impact of the Some way of victorious in the new jungle background for creative rounds. We're excited to see what you can do too. We have increased the macro bio some objects you can place to get some body shield, spinning plates, fans, pendulums, and more. We made some significant changes to the beating gameplay to meet your time in the blunder room and overall better experience. 
Many of these changes have been guided by the Fall Guys community feedback and we're excited to get your thoughts on the rollout. We made some adjustments to raise the the act of physics to make the situation more fun game for students. You will still ragdoll when hit by obstacles, but we will know if you just want to be able to do it. Take a look at the way you go and find yourself more on the floor. And if you want to see the game up, themselves for elimination if they find themselves being aimed in the sky. You will see a landing target below you before performing big jumps to guide you to a safe spot. You will be able to turn this off the same for those that can wish to use it. Due to the improvements above, you may find you need to make changes to your critical level. Or to give you a heads up so you know what things to look out for when reviewing a level. This could, players can make jumps they couldn't before. This could mean players can jump out of your level or find ways to navigate obstacles in new ways. If it views a year to flip it across the gap, it's worth checking to make sure that leap is still possible due to the changes we have made to the beam, the physics ragdolling. We've had to make some tweaks to obstacles such as the size of padded walls in order to keep those more athletic beams inside the boundaries of your level. If your level uses these, it's worth checking to see if the design needs altering. You don't have to make changes to your physical level to be straight, but we believe that some short term challenges are worth it for the improvements to the game. We are with the up. We will be able to get closer to that once we roll out these changes. Again, I'm full. I don't want to lose. Wanting each mode to be fresh more frequently to find the movers play. No kind of formal consoles is most fun when there are surprises and new ways to master. Starting from now, we will speak significantly with Jason Loves a Knockout on a regular basis. Knockout will be a fetish for the exercise of formulas and media tonic and careers. Rounds not currently in the knockout game will change will still be able to play in custom games. Knockout games will now consist of three rounds and 30 players. When I get given Fall Guys, it's an amazing moment. At the same time, Bob wins to be achievable for our players. By allowing playing for knockout knockout shows, we hope to push the balance in a more healthy direction. This will tell us that we will be able to start the game and we'll gain the life time. Woof! <laughs> 
same round for the knockout. Knockout refreshes are not going to be a repeat of World King. The aim of the knockout is that each refresh made by the old classic that we are player love. Well. Why not just keep adding levels? You know that if levels are going to be more than you expect because each addition has a smaller and smaller chance to be It's also fun to master levels, and this gets harder the pool gets too big. By keeping the level process consistent, we can make exciting drastic changes to fall guys. We are keeping the morality of the fall guys fun. The games that are just of our two main game modes, knockout, solos, duos, squads, and explorers. This is just another back to the game that I want to focus on the very new and exciting levels of improvement, knockout, and explorer. Our aim of this adjustment is that we provide variety in the modes that most of the LKS game that are also occasionally in the classic LKS game below. We have increased the amount of fame you can earn in knockout rounds and challenges, making it easier to earn rewards in the fame path. Let's see what costumes are up for grabs with the latest game pass. Look closely, the comfy carry costume looks like piggybacking players, but it's just one bean. The rainbow corn costume is a grinning unicorn for chromatic tutu. What a thrill. Plus, you'll look fire when you unlock the Sir Blaze Bright costume. We want more players to be able to put the hat in order to achieve that we have increased the amount of fame earned to put in levels of challenges. We have also just the total FPQ of 370. Unlock these goodies and more in a new game pass from May 7th to June 4th. Bug fixes. The like and dislike panel now uses its own inputs on the celebration screen, meaning they will no longer block you from skipping celebrations. Fixed various issues, making it easier for players to cancel their mantles in creative round. Fixed an issue, stopping players from using trapeze on Switch. Fixed an issue where other players would sometimes turn invisible when using a trapeze on Switch. Fixed an issue where crime angle wards were not shown during the rewards flow. Fixed an issue around cooldown and duration bars for power ups not showing correctly in private lobbies. Boom Blaster VFX do not show when standing at certain distances. Fixed an issue causing costumes do not show the customizer after purchasing a team skip. Fixed an issue some players select from showing after using default power up. So there you have it. Fall Forever brings a significant amount of changes to Fall Guys that we hope you enjoy. We would love to hear your feedback on the changes mentioned in your various official channels. Please remember to always report any in game issues you face to our wonderful support team. Your feedback and reports are so vital in helping us keep Fall Guys as fun, playable, and excited as possible. That's it guys, that's the Fall Guys the Fall Forever update information that you have for the video. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the release.